Each day this week, we're introducing you to remarkable kids, and today we meet a kid in Pine Bluff who is remarkable both on and off the court. My favorite thing to do is play basketball. 12 year old TJ Brown has dreams. I want to be in the NBA. Big dreams. Do you just want to be in the NBA or do you want to dominate the NBA? Dominate. Like a lot of kids his age. I want to play for the Los Angeles Lakers or the Golden State Warriors. He wants to be like NBA star Stephen Curry. And Steph will go to the side. When they move, Steph goes this way, uh -huh. drives in, floater. But the reason is not what you think. I appreciate the way Steph helps his community. TJ Brown is a remarkable kid, not because of his skill, but because of his heart. Just by being myself, acting good, have a good behavior, being respectful to other people. Who taught you that? My mom. And you're like, wow, this kid's great. Emily Burris works at the Boys and Girls Club of Jefferson County, where TJ and dozens of other kids are spending their summer. One of our rules is make your mentors happy. A rule TJ has always followed. TJ is an awesome member to have here. He helps out all the time, half the time without like anyone asking, like any adult asking. He's just really down to like be a helper. Helping others while dealing with some really hard things himself. A lot of people bullied me when I was little. How do you overcome the bullying and be respectful like you are? I just do what I do. I don't, I just black them out. If they, they talk about me, I just walk away. Is it hard to do? Not at all. TJ walks away to another one of his hobbies, reading. In French, the word mortgage means death contract. I like to read things that are exciting, like something that's make my head go wild. In the classroom, <laughs> on the court. TJ! And that when you shoot it, flick your wrist. All right. Try it. Okay. A positive influence. Close. Close. And whether his shots fall or not, <sighs> TJ Brown is one remarkable kid we would all like <gasps> on our team. It's promising that if we have leaders like this, that the other kids will follow their example and see, well, this is how TJ is doing, and TJ is getting this recognition here. We're going to act more like this. I'm going to shoot it right here. Congratulations. That's awesome. TJ, by the way, <laughs> said that he gets some of that payback on the bullies that bully him on the basketball court, not by talking back, but by beating them. Mm. <laughs> final score, scoreboard, they say. Tomorrow, our final remarkable kid, a girl who is feeding the stomachs and the spirit of the homeless. And I tell you what, over the past five days, I've met people and kids in this community that, that make me feel good about the future. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> Can we go back awesome. to what was the final score that game? Uh, he <laughs> won, uh, we played a five and he won five or six to one. Wow. Well on his way to the NBA. Yeah. You know, whatever. Dream. You know, I'm just, I'm just, he's a good kid, you know, and he's uh, doing his thing and he's not fighting back bullets, he's turning his bullets. I like, bullies I, like turning what he, I like what he said, though, or what you said that he said, which is that, you know, don't fight back with mm. words or anything. Yeah. Just let beat your, him let your skill court. beat him <laughs> on the court and do it mm. fair. I think that's, that's really sweet.